Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper. This is my two-minute entertainment rundown for the week of February 7th. Natalie Portman is back on the screen in the Western Jane Got a Gun, and her co-stars are Joel Edgerton, Ewan McGregor, and Noah Emery. And she plays a frontiers woman, and she and her husband have to stand up and protect their land against the notorious Bishop Gang. Pure Western all the way through. It's rated R for profanity and violence. I enjoyed it. I scored it 7 out of 10. Then we have the Coen Brothers' latest film. It's called Hail Caesar, and it is a spoof of Hollywood in the 50s. It's got a cast that goes on and on forever, but nobody in the movie really gets a full storyline. George Clooney is the most featured, and his part is the most boring of the film. It's rated PG-13 for profanity, some adult situations. I scored it 4 out of 10. Then we have the combination of Jane Austen and zombies in a movie called Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. Lily James, who played Cinderella, plays Elizabeth Bennet. The whole story of the Bennet sisters that was spelled out in Pride and Prejudice is mashed up against a zombie horror story, but somehow it works. It's fun. It also is rated PG-13 because there's mild profanity and there is the zombie violence. I scored this movie 6 out of 10. The final movie is The Choice. This is a movie based on a Nicholas Sparks book. With that, you get romance and tragedy always thrown in in equal parts. It's got kind of an unknown cast, but it's still a good love story. It's rated PG-13 for profanity and adult situations. I scored it 6 out of 10. Next week, we're going to have Deadpool, How to Be Single, and Zoolander 2. This has been Jackie K. Cooper's 2-Minute Entertainment Rundown.